everyone. I'm here with Monica Lee at Planet Comic Con, and I'm here, and I'm going to ask her a couple questions about her amazing cosplays. Uh, <laughs> As you point, you're like, ugh. <laughs> uh, the first one I have is, what got you into costuming? Uh, I started cosplaying in 2006, so it's about, about nine or so years. Um, I was really into anime back then. I was like the biggest weeaboo ever. I guess I still kind of am. Um, but I'd found people cosplaying online and stuff. And I still don't know to this day what possessed me to be like, oh, I'm going to do that too. But all I know is that it's been downhill, uphill from there. And just like, it's just, it's cool because everyone loves dressing up, especially girls and stuff. So it's like my nerdy prom, you know, except I'm dressed up as Scooby-Doo. <laughs> what was the first costume you ever did? Oh, Lord. Uh, my first costume, like I said, I was a big weeb. I was related to Naruto. Uh, I did Tamari during the time skip, and I had the big fan. I thought I was like the most like badass person ever. And now looking at pictures, I'm like, no, Monica, you a loser. <laughs> well, everyone has to start somewhere, right? Yeah, I suppose. mean, <laughs> I remember my first costume, and it was not not. We don't talk about those times. Yeah, we don't. <laughs> just forget they ever happened. Um, when, how old were you when you started costuming? Um, I was 13, uh, and I'm 22 now, so I'm still I'm very young for what I do. But it feels like I've been doing it forever. So it's weird that like I'm like jaded in like such a young hobby at such a young age by doing this. But I mean, it's it's cool. Like I can't imagine like now like doing anything else. Like maybe I'd be playing my clarinet or something. Like sadly in my room, I don't know. <laughs> so you've gained a lot of fame with your costumes over the last couple of years. <laughs> Be coming to conventions like this as guests. Um, how does it feel to have grown so much? Like, do you think your 13-year-old self would have ever thought you'd be <laughs> at a giant convention like this as a guest? Well, I think just in the community in general, this, like, what this is, like, not just cons, but, like, be, like cosplayers being guests is not a thing. Um, I'd say it's a really new growth as of maybe two or three years ago. Um, and as, I guess, like, Costa was has been so young, as it's kind of, like, grown, you know, and gained notoriety. Maybe not notoriety, that's not the right name. Uh, <laughs> like, like, recognition and stuff, people are realizing this is a really cool thing. Let's bring people as guests and stuff because they make cool stuff. And so I'd say, like, not even just, like, 13-year-old self, but, like, it did exist in the community, period. And so it's still weird that, like, I travel around the place and I get to dress up. Like, oh, my life is so hard, you know? Like... And it's, I still, it's, it's weird to me because, like, I'm a full-time student. When I'm at school, like, I don't get people that are like, oh, my God, are you so-and-so cosplay? I'm just like, oh, no more Georgia Tech. <laughs> so it's, it's just weird. It's not normal. <laughs> well, thank you so much for talking to me. Thank you, thank you for being a guest out here at Plant Comic Con this I'm year. I'm so glad everyone's had me. Everyone's been super nice. Besides that one guy that tried to rob my friend's luggage this morning. Um, but everyone's been really cool. And uh, the Iowa State people were special. Um, so we hope we could come back soon. It's been awesome. <laughs>